Practice Warriors, what's going on? Today's video is going to be like a message that I wish I was told as a kid with Pectus Excavatum. So I wish someone had sat me down and told me this exact thing. You can't improve it, Riley. I wish they had told me that. That is the most important belief system to have. You have to believe anything in life. You have to have the mindset. You have to fully believe that you can achieve something. Otherwise, you won't achieve it. Like... If you can believe it, you can achieve it. It is the truth. So I wish someone had told me that. I wish I hadn't have just wallowed in my own pity, in my own, oh, I have this, and crying at night and stuff, and had it just been told, work hard and you'll improve your body so much that it no longer negatively affects you. Because that is the most important message ever. The fact that you can do something about it. And, it, and that transcends into life. Like no matter what you wanna do, if you work hard, you can improve it. You can improve your life circumstances. You can improve your financial position. You can improve whatever you want to improve. So I wish someone had told me that. I wish they had said, the harder you work, the better the results as well, because that's the truth as well. The more work you put into something, the better the results. So if you work hard, if you're consistent with your diet, if you track your macros, if you ensure you're in a surplus if you're trying to gain, or you ensure you get hitting that protein intake, and then you ensure you're getting stronger on your lifts, the more effort you put into something, the better the reward. So I wish I was told, really enforced the concepts of like discipline, hard work, and really understood the reward system from putting in hard work. I learned that on my own, so I'm so thankful that I've learned that because for me, that has completely transformed my life, is knowing that you have to put in the work to achieve whatever you want to achieve. And that's so, so, so relevant for pectus. You have to put in the work to build up your chest to disguise your indent. You have to do the stretches to correct your posture. You have to do all of those things, all of those building blocks to get you to where you want to be. The next thing I wish I was told is you have pectus and you have to learn to accept it and love yourself. That is so important. You have to love yourself. You have to understand where you are. You have to have the self-awareness to be happy with who you are. Learn to love yourself and then learn to understand that you can improve who you are. You can build upon that through hard work. So I wish I was told that as well. I guess I, I guess another message would just be like, stop beating yourself up so much, man. Like. No one cares as much as you think they do. That's another really important message that I wish I was told. It's like no one, like sure people might see it and they might say something, they might point at it and say, what's that? But that's it. They don't think of you as a lesser human being for having pectus. And now I know a lot of you might be thinking, well, girls probably are less attracted to me. Well, then that could be the case. But like I said before, you can build up your body so much so that they don't notice it as much. And also, if the girl is the right one for you, there's a lot more than just your body that counts. And so hopefully they're looking at your personality and all the other things as well. So that's just my little um, message that I wish I was told with Pectus as a kid. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep making games.